Hey guys, welcome to a day with us. Today's video is going to be a little bit different. It's just me today. Josie's not here. Zoe's not here. What ended up happening was that about two or three days ago, Josie's grandma came up from Miami and came to visit us. She hung out with us. She helped us a little bit. We were, we're pretty much behind on a lot of things when it comes to, uh, you know, our baby coming pretty much now at the end of uh, April or beginning of May before, uh, you know, Josie's grandma left. She actually wanted her to go down with her for a couple of days and then I'll go over there and pick her up. Um, and that way they can spend a little bit more time together. So that's actually giving me a perfect opportunity because uh, I had the idea of making the nursery and kind of surprising Josie, but I didn't know how I was gonna do that. The nursery is actually not done at all, which is the reason why I'm making this video. Not that I'm picking everything, Josie picks everything. She has great taste in all of the stuff that she picks and the colors, she has everything picked out, but I'm gonna pretty much grab all of that and assemble it for her. But hopefully by the time she comes back, this whole thing is ready. And um, you know that way it surprises her and, and shows her you know because I want to do this to show her my appreciation for her because she does so much and she's an amazing wife and um, uh, at the same time I want to remove some stress from both of our shoulders because this room is not ready whatsoever and the baby's coming at any second now so I'm just gonna go ahead and jump into it I'm gonna start decluttering the room first and then I'm gonna start um, you know just prepping everything for the paint but yeah I'll take you guys on the road as I figure it out This is the room. This is kind of like just showing you guys a little bit of the before. We were using this room for a lot of different things. It was kind of slash a guest room. Um, this is also a storage room for stuff that we don't use around the house. This is where we're keeping some of the baby stuff. And uh, as you can see, it's not ready whatsoever. Look at this pink fan up here. We got to change that. We're going to be, I don't know if you guys can see it here, I already have it marked. So I'm going to be, well, what Josie wanted to do was um, do two colors. It's going to be a beige and a kind of like a beige cream color and a white so she wants to start out with uh, lines about that thick of beige then white then beige white beige white and you pretty much get it all the way down to the floor that's pretty much it i just want to show you guys a little before show you how this room looks and as you guys can see let me show you one last look this is the before so let's empty out this room and now that we got the room completely decluttered, um, I took everything out. I actually went ahead and already did the uh, the cream paint, but it turns out that I actually got all the colors messed up completely. It was not a beige per se and a white that she wanted to do. When I took a look at the cans, it was actually two different colors. It was one of them is a beige, it's like a light cream. And then the other one is more of a caramel color. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and show you guys those colors so you guys can see what they are. These are it right here. You guys can pause that right there and take a look at the name and the number. Josie got them at Lowe's. So for all the DIY people who want to do it, if you like how this room turns out and you want to get those colors, by all means, go for it. Uh, this, the wall I painted the entire room, I painted it uh, the lighter color, which is going to be this one right here, the cream color. And that's what's going to be um, Pretty much, those are gonna be one of the lines. So up here, you're gonna have the darker color. I'm gonna start out with that one. And then that's how I'm gonna start doing my lines. I went ahead and already started prepping for all of the uh, taping that I need to do um, so that I can start then doing the darker color now. And I actually kind of did a little DIY here. Found this old laser that I had in uh, my garage and I got our filming tripod. I kind of put them both together and once you turn off the light, this is why I chose this, is because it makes it so much easier, in my opinion. It makes it a lot easier to be able to uh, uh, put the tape up, because um, I just follow the uh, laser, and it makes it so much
Look at all that tape. That's why this took forever. I'm finally completely done with all the painting in the room. This is day three, I think. It's taken me a lot longer than I thought it was, um, simply because I was not working on this all day. I had to cut it in sections because I had other things to do throughout the day as well. Uh, I'm actually gonna go pick up Josie. It's not going according to plan because I was supposed to have all of this done, except the furniture, because the furniture is actually in Miami, so that's, not only am I gonna pick up Josie, but I'm gonna pick up the furniture as well and bring it all back here. My plan is, I guess I have to improvise, and my plan is not to let her go into that room whatsoever. She knows that I'm working on it. She knows that I'm not done working on it. And then once I finish everything, then somehow um, I'll get everything situated in there and uh, get her reaction. It's time to show them the reveal. I'm gonna try to get Zoe's reaction first, see if she likes the room. Usually she's pretty expressive when she likes something. Wow. There you went straight for the camera. Look at the room, baby. Mira. Wow. The wow, yeah. Wow's a dog, by the way, guys. I thought I was gonna get a reaction, but out of Zoe, but nope, not this time. Time to get Josie's reaction. All right, babe. Yup. Wow, I was not expecting it to look like this. Mama. Oh my god. <laughs> <gasps> oh. Boy, oh, that we... looks really good, baby. Oh, it is. What do you mean? You said it didn't make oh, it, it didn't make it feel more real. How does it not make it feel more real to you? I guess as I was just going through the whole process of it, I'm not just like seeing it all at once. Yeah, I actually like it like seeing like like the crib and everything here, if it made it more real to you, you said no. Cause it, well, to me it's already real. Like I know he's coming at any second now. Oh my gosh, hold on. I don't even, I don't have waterproof mascara on, so. You like the room, doo doo? Oh my gosh, it looks so wow. good. And this is like, I mean it's not even done cause I still have like a couple of things I wanna like put. Yeah, I told them. Oh my gosh, what the heck? That you wanna do the show. This made me so emotional. Oh man, I'm so happy that I didn't freaking cheat. Like, cause I was so tempted to cheat. I know. <laughs> and I, 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 I knew that you wanted to, but I knew you weren't going to. Yeah. I, I think it looks good. Not even because I did it, but I think that it looks good. No, it looks amazing. Like, it really, really, really does. Like, I'm, I love you with the little right there, so funny. Oh. And then all the little decorations and stuff. Yeah, I don't know if you want to put the little basky or, uh. Um, Basket. Um. And then oh my gosh, the crib. So oh, and this is how the frame looks. Oh my gosh, wow. Wow. So oh, this frame nice. is pretty cool. It has all the animals. Because these doorknobs before, these doorknobs, they used to be um, flowers. Yeah, and then I changed them to black. Well, I'm I have, sure they know that because you were showing them the process, no? I didn't film that part. Wow, that looks really good. Don't let her drop that trap. I want to take off these um, shelves though because it's not like, it's not practical. Though. Yeah, no. I still have some stuff in there though. Wow. It looks so good, babe, for real. Like, no lie. And I actually like, I actually like this. You like this fan? Yeah, I actually, actually really like the fan. 
I thought it looked good, um, but I think that the other fan will look better. Like the one the that we want. Pin? Yeah, the airplane yeah. one. I mean, yeah, it'll, it'll tie everything together. It'll make it look more like a nursery or like a baby, like whatever. <laughs> but I feel like the walls. The walls definitely. The walls steal the show. They, they do give a lot. That's why I was saying, like, even if you don't put a rug, I think a no, rug will look put a nice. Rug for sure, because rug catches, like, you see all this little dirt and stuff? Yeah. But for sure, like, like the long. walls already make it feel like it's not as empty as it really is. Because really all we have here is just like, what, the crib, a mirror, and a vanity, and that's pretty much it. Um, so there's really not much else in this room compared to uh, Zoe's room. So I think the walls definitely wow, get a lot. Baby. Wow. So, rated 1 out of 10. 10? It, meet, it met every single one of my expectations. And the world map looks so nice there. What do you think, Tutu? I love it. What do you think? <laughs> See? Where are you chomping on those things? Yeah. Mm -hmm. She got <gasps> Baby? Baby? Mira? Baila. Baila. Mama bailar. Dale. Show them how you dance. Baila. Hey. <laughs> hey guys, this is the end of this video for us. I am absolutely obsessed with the room. It like it, I feel like I met every one of my expectations and it like it looks nicer than what I envisioned it. Because I did tell Danny like my ideas and what I wanted for the mm -hmm. room. But it just looks way better than what I thought it was gonna look like. And originally I was gonna do the stripes on one wall, but like last minute I told him like to just do the entire room. So I had no like literally this room like I don't even have words <laughs> as Whoa. you can tell. What is she doing? What are you doing, Zoe? Get the mama. What, are you, what are you doing? The floor is dirty, baby. She's had an obsession lately with like laying on the floor and stuff. But um, so this room is obviously not done like we were saying. I'm still gonna fill the cabinets up with the baby's clothes, you know, finish the closet, put up the shelves of last decorations and all that stuff. And obviously I'm gonna film that for you guys so that you guys can be part of the process. But I'm not, I'm probably not gonna do that today. Because today I'm like feeling like, but maybe later on in this week, I'm gonna have like a little bit more energy. I'm gonna come in here and, and organize the drawers and show you guys like how I put everything in there. Well, yeah. that's pretty much it we guys. We love you guys so much. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for staying throughout the whole video with me. Thank you, babe. I love it. end of the video and spending a day with us but before you go we do have a very important but quick question to ask you guys before we ask you that question i want to let you know that god loves you so much and he has an amazing plan for your life but god forbid that you were to die this very second do you know without a shadow of a doubt that you go to heaven see the truth is that no one knows when we're going to die because tomorrow is never guaranteed you can go to bed right now lay your head on a pillow and never know if you'll wake up tomorrow the bible says that for god so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believes in him will not perish but have eternal life the bible also says for whosoever calls upon the name of the lord shall be saved and you're a whosoever right of course you are we all are i'm just going to go ahead and say a quick prayer of blessing over your life we're going to pray for you guys father in the name of jesus i pray that you bless whoever's watching this video them and their family with long healthy lives i pray that you make yourself so real to them and you do a quick work in their heart if they have not received you yet as their lord and savior i pray that they do so right now so repeat after me with your heart and your lips out loud dear lord jesus come into my heart forgive me of my sins wash me and cleanse me set me free i thank you that you died for me i believe that you were risen from the dead and that you're coming back again for me fill me with your holy spirit give me a passion for the lost a hunger for the things of god and a boldness to preach your gospel i'm saved i'm born again i am forgiven and I'm on my way to heaven because I have Jesus in my heart. Amen. If you prayed this prayer, we just want to let you guys know. Um, congratulations. Welcome to the family. Make sure you always run to God and not away from him because he loves you so much. And he has mm -hmm. an amazing plan for your life. We love you guys. God bless you. Bye.